Hey guys, welcome to another awesome video from Decker Network. Today we're looking at how to create um, a product which will cover an all over print or even adapt an existing product to cover an all over print. So you can see here that I have um, a t-shirt in my website and let's say I have the facility to actually do a full cover print um, across the whole entire t-shirt. So I want to set that up for one of my products and it's relatively easy to do so. So first off I'm going to come to my product and I will select the decoration areas tab and then this is going to give me all of my decoration areas and all of my product views and then what I'm going to do is on the front I'm going to click on the blue wheel here and just select allow custom decoration areas advanced and then I'm going to click into the t-shirt where I can add a new decoration area. But before I do that I need to create what's called a decoration mask. This is going to be a black shape which will then determine the printable area on the product, similar to what you see here, but it will be more fitting for an all over print on the t-shirt. So over into Photoshop I go, and you can see here that I've just copied and pasted the image into Photoshop, and what I need to do is first off remove the background um, colour here. So I'm just going to change here some of the tolerance. and select the background color using the magic font tool and just delete that away. Then um, with the layer selected I'm going to click on the effects link down here, the layer style and then I'm going to click color overlay and what I'll do here is just change this to full black. Now I can save this and use that as a decoration area but I want to take it a little bit further and also create a bleed here. So what I'm going to do is click on stroke and then I can choose here how big I want the bleed to be. So I'm going to say around there, that, 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 that kind of looks good. Then I'm going to change the colour again to black. Press OK but this time I'm going to bring the opacity down to 50. And you can see here it's creating a transparent outline there. And then I'm just going to click OK and that's my decoration mask all ready to go. So I'm just going to save this now as a PNG. And I can call this anything I want to, but I'm going to call this mask. And then I'm going to head back over into my products. And I'm going to click add new area. And I'm going to select define a new area. I'm going to call this all over print. Press OK and it's going to give me here a new shape and of course I don't want it to be a rectangle I want it to be the shape I just created so here I'm going to click on the upload shape option click choose file here's my PNG mask and you can see here it's pulled it in so I'm going to just unlock this and I'm now going to resize it up to how I want it to be and you can see here just as I resize it to the size of the t-shirt you can see the bleed lines coming in nicely there just on the outside of a t-shirt so you may um, have a bit more time than me to um, put the decoration mask in so there we go that looks pretty cool uh, not the neatest but it's there so now I can unlock this and I can set the width and height accordingly and then I will choose which print method this will apply for so I don't really want to um, have this for embroidery that's going to create um, something that resembles a bit of an armor plate t-shirt and maybe I don't want to go for DTG but I'm going to stick with sublimation so I'm going to press OK and then I'm just going to click save and this is now going to um, add that decoration area to the product and then your customers can now go to that product select that decoration area and they can um, add an image which will cover the entire t-shirt so if I just head back to my product listing we'll take a look at how this will operate now on the website Here I'm just going to click Sublimation and I'm going to um, select the all over print down here and if I just add design and sublimation design I'm going to pull in um, an image that I have here so let's pull in the skater and you can see that as I expand the image it covers the entire t-shirt and we can also see the bleed 
around the edge of a t-shirt here so that's going to uh, help you with any print shifts and it's also going to um, help a customer uh, position it as well and you might show the customer that there may be a bit of cropping um, or image shifting as well there so that is how you create an all over image printable area for your products on Declan Network